it's been an interesting process kind of like saying goodbye to the character because, um, you know, if I, I, people assume somehow you're playing some version of yourself, which is really not true. And I, I think when I first started playing the character, I was really looking for uh, ways to identify, like, oh, this links up. And it was kind of an, it was an accident that we're, Carter and I are both from Ohio. But um, I was looking for ways to identify, and it became more fun when I started to think of him as this other thing, and I could lean into his goofiness and make him this other thing. Um, and sometimes I found him to be, uh, I've described him as, uh, some days he was like my annoying younger brother, where I was like, what are you doing now? Like, don't do that. That's not a good move. <laughs> and other days, I was like, wow, this guy, I'm learning a lot from this guy. He's, he's like heroic and optimistic and persistent, sometimes in the wrong direction, but he, he really goes for it. And um, so I feel like he's been like a teacher for me. And another, another thing that, that's kind of interesting just from a, larger perspective is because the character doesn't really get a win and the big win until the end I mean that's what the whole thing is and and was constantly getting knocks I I never had a moment where I felt like woo made it in Hollywood <laughs> like I always felt like he was a teacher of humility for me I know that maybe sounds a little silly but he really he really kept my pride in check because he was um he was going through a lot and I had to honor him and and be with all that. So sometimes it was really hard and sometimes I didn't want to be playing that, if I'm really honest. And other days I felt I couldn't be lucky. I'm the luckiest guy in the world to be playing this guy. So it was a, it was a lot. It was a complicated thing, but it was, it was wonderful. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you.